property which I plan to put to good use. <laughs> no close calls at all. Whatever. Is that it? That's it. See you around. Time? Never for you. You're not here to apply for a grant, are you? I don't know. Can you set me up with something? What's wrong? Nothing. I, I, uh, I got something for you. A letter. From Stone. things, I knew that um, you'd want it right away. I'm gonna go ahead and disappear. Wait, honey. Don't leave. This is a letter. The only one he ever wrote. And I'd like to share it with you of all people. Okay. For sure. I'm sure. With the understanding that if, uh, it starts to get too personal. You stop reading, okay? I'm great. Dear Robin, this is the first letter I ever wrote. <laughs> right that it is to you because without you I wouldn't be able to do this much I'm writing it now because I think pretty soon I won't be able to see to do it I love you I will not say goodbye to you. <clears throat> I do not know where I'm going but I believe it is to some place. And I will go on loving you from there always. If I did not know you, I would not mind dying. <laughs> because I love you, I do not want to leave my life. I just want to hold you and look at you and listen to you. And, and this seems so beautiful to me and so good that it hurts. And, there's a pain in my chest, and it is my heart. You read the rest. Uh, okay. I want your life to be long and full of love, because then you will be happy. I want you to have years to give the world what you gave me because it will be better place like I am better because you love me and then wherever it is I will see you again stone It breaks my heart to think of the effort it was to take him to do that. With the dyslexia, vision failing more every day. I think it's called a labor of love. I wonder where he is. Someplace better. Right? 
And I believe what he said, too. That he's still loving me from whatever he is. Same way I'm loving him. But even so... so strong, I think I can just reach out and touch his face. And then I realize I can't. Not ever. It hurts so bad. But as painful as it is, I don't want that sense of him to go away because that means I'm forgetting him and I don't want to do that. You never will. You know, we... We may get to a place where we're not thinking about him every waking minute. But we'll never forget. Your mother. I learned the same thing from losing my parents. Because I just forgot for a minute. feel as lost as much as I do. But I've got all these people around me wanting to help me. Why don't you let Brenda help me? Stop. Right there. There's something you need to know, Robin. Okay. The only person who's going to help me through these hard times is the woman I plan to marry. And that's Lily. <laughs> that's crazy, Sonny. Call me crazy. But it doesn't make sense. Yeah, well, well. Of course you and Brenda have been having problems. There, wait, Everybody there, knows there, that. There is no me and Brenda. But I saw you guys. I was there the other night, remember? Yeah. When we scatter stone ashes, it's so obvious how you guys feel about each other. H how could you possibly marry Lily? Because I, I because I trust Lily. <sighs> when I look when I look at a future with Lily, I see nice and steady and dependable, no cliffs to fall over. This is important to me. More important than love. It... <laughs> Sonny, if you do this, you're going to be making a. Terrible mistake. No, no, no. See, the, 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 the mistake would be to get involved with Brenda again. Does she know about this? Yeah. And? And she, uh, she had a bad reaction bec because she knows that I am right. We are not good together over the long haul. This is... This is... This is, this is blowing me away. Hey, How counsel, could you... there's a counselor. Sonny? How you doing, buddy? Robin? Hi, Justice. I've been, uh, I've been meaning to call you. Oh, is that so? You're not in trouble again. No, no, no. I, I just, uh, I want to thank you for, uh, I know you've been taking a lot of flack for representing me, and, uh, even if it was temporary. Yeah, well, you got that right. I even raided my own personal audience with the mayor, who was not too thrilled at the time. Is that like getting called into the principal's office? <laughs> you got it. But I made it clear I'm not in uh, private practice right now. I'm not on retainer for you. Didn't receive any payment for my services. Just a little pro bono work on behalf of a citizen's right to due process. Cool, cool. Looks like you handled it. Hey, man, I thought I was beyond cool. Right. But city right. council went ahead and scheduled an emergency closed-door session anyway. Right. Three guesses why. Damn, I'm really sorry. Well, don't be. 